out of town. Don't worry, it's not because there's guys in town that want to kill you. It's because the guys that want to kill you are out of town, too. Just meet me at Yellow Jacks and Sandy Shores and I'll explain. And bring your people. Oh, dog, shit. Why you slow dragging? Bring your ass on. Hey, look here. According to this online course I've been taking, nothing says leadership material better than taking opportunities, right? So what better opportunities we got to put the Vagos out of business than to go shoot up the funeral of the boy little Al that y'all killed in the drive-by? <laughs> yeah, I know it's distasteful and very, very, very early 90s-ish, but fuck it. That's what these folks understand, and that's what I'm about. This is San Andreas, home of vine wood. Man, we don't do modern here, my nigga. We like shit the way it was. Old-fashioned gangster shit. And with that being said, we gonna push up to the funeral, and we gonna spray all his homies while they in mourning. <laughs> I swear to God I'm a gangster shit guru. You love that shit, don't you? You love that shit. This is history, and you part of it. So y'all get dressed and I'ma hit you in a minute. Good luck, my nigga. But y'all don't need that though, cause y'all down with LD. Ha <laughs> ha! Move it! Get a job, Buster. suits to the gas station around the way. You gonna run up on some on the way there. Take them out and take their ride. That's how you creeping on the funeral. It's gonna be way too many essays to do it any other way. Hey, and I'm giving you small weapons for this thing. Other dudes that hear anything big and scary. Cool. 
I mean, you're a morning after all. I mean, you're supposed to be like sad as fuck. Just slide on in with the other whips and go on up to the church. Like you good, they think you one of them. I should probably say right now, man, this ain't just about shooting up a funeral. Not to disrespect shooting up funerals as a worthwhile use of time. I mean, it just turns out they've been smuggling Yayo in the corpses, and that's what's in the coffins. So once we hit the essays, we're gonna be boosting dead dudes. Finest Mexican taxidermy, homie. Stuffed Thanksgiving turkeys like Aunt Lamar likes to make them. We're here to pay our respect to the homies. They were soldiers, both of them. Vagos for life and death. They lived like men. And they died like men. Hey, you know how they say every cloud's got a silver lining? That's bullshit. Some clouds got no linings. They just depressing. And that's what this is. It's depressing. I grew up with these two. They were great men. Killers. Fighters. Warriors. Proud members of their community. Then again, some dead homies did leave some trash bags full of cocaine in the attic. So let's all stop looking so upset, eh? To the homies! To the, the homies. homies! And all that coco. Brothers for life. Yeah. Right here. Now's the time. Go hard on them essays. Side pieces only, man. Show some respect.
That's it. That got us back on track. Check this out, man. We are breaking eggs. We just breaking eggs. We're about to make this great big huge egg thing. That's it. Lots of eggs. Eggs. Motherfucking eggs. Gangsta shit, nigga. Ah, poetry, man. That's what the world needs. A handsome, charismatic, well-spoken leader like myself. That's what I bring to the table. And lots of motherfucking eggs. <laughs>